Hello, this is Sean C, and welcome back to my run of Ark Sotalis. So, in the last video, we did a bunch of stuff. Not a huge amount, but we've got ourselves here to get the next part of the main quest. Will you let me pass? There is the path. Traveler of the Noen. Walk between the two serpents, and you will find our Mother Superior. She and only she can help you find Soark. Was that a yet? <laughs> The second, that didn't sound like she was letting me in. Zalnash awaits you. A snake woman. She's clearly going to not have a lot to say. She doesn't even deserve a name. I think there's a shop here, actually. Teleporter? Okay, maybe you have to be a snake to use that. I feel like, yeah, I think there's a shop here, like a... Wait. I can't remember, do people care about stealing? Cooking for goblins, I think we need that. Need that reveal as well. I don't know if I can cast it. Can I cast it? Unreal. We can just about do level six. Well, we can just using a. Hey, it's an easy spell. So we'll just sell it and you know, cast it ourselves. Yeah, they don't worry, uh, worry about us robbing them blind. I couldn't remember. That's going to be the one we're going to talk to. I'm just going to see what else we can do. Oh, uh, okay, that's where we managed to sneak into earlier on. Probably should have opened the door, but I, I just feel like I remember them killing you. <laughs> ah, this is good. Fantastic. Uh, what was the spell for this? Mega Septum, I think. Mega. Mega. So. Do you know what? It's going to be in here somewhere. <laughs> uh, Mega Spatium. Two more levels to find. A handy teleportation device. Okay, so I thought there's a shop in here, but clearly there is not. Uh, so let's go speak to this uh, lady. Oh, ladies. Trio. So we are the guardians. She's still just a snake woman. Object they call Zohar. Interesting. And what made you think the Order would want to allow such an object out of our possession for your sake? It's quite simple. Akba is preparing to complete his reincarnation in Arcs and wreak systematic destruction on every living being in this dimension. I am the only one capable of stopping this process, but I need the legendary Zohar to help me. <laughs> Very good. But the core of the problem. That was blinging, I look now. I love the fact at the start you're just like an absolute peasant, bare chested, stood in front of the king. As now I'm actually glowing. Two objects that can 
protect your magical energy. Unscra House was stolen by a group of rebels. Loonshire has consistently failed in I've literally got it in my pocket right now. Get it back for us. I will find Cra House. You will find it. Unless perhaps you already have it. But that's not the problem. For now, <laughs> destroying Akba has to be the priority. You must emerge victorious. From the discernment and challenge, it is an ordeal which must be attempted by each new recruit to our order. You have to succeed in passing through the Temple of Illusion. If you do, you may take Zohark, and you will also be protected against all the illusions Akba will try to use on you. Here is the key to our temple. Sweet. So we've got another little trials to do. Oh gosh. Yes, sir. If you cannot emerge victorious, we can talk to you. We can talk to you. Very comfortable place to live, is it? Yes, sir. Did I just sleep in the corner? So I think the temple is around here. At the other end of this tunnel. Let's go uh let's go try that. Yeah, it's, it's just funny, like it's say we look so blinging now, but and they're all glowing. But I remember at the start I literally stood in front of the king bare chested. And that guy looks a bit uh intense. Look at him. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go down here first because why not? Okay, so I feel that's the exit. Some uh, weird sounds coming from in there. Okay. Remember this area. Level seven. Oh, what's that? The Earth Clan's treasure. It's quite a while ago. Ugh. What the hell is going on down here? I'm pretty sure, like this doesn't get explained either. This is just, uh, this is just how these guys roll. I'm just gonna quickly have a quick poke around. Um, yeah. Okay, it's the rat dudes. Two fireballs and about ten hits. Is that a heal? Maybe. Ah, oh my god. He's yet to land a hit on me because he's done juking about. Uh, how much experience have we gained? Okay. I just don't think there's a huge amount of experience you get from killing on this game. Obviously, it's, it's an amount, but compared to quests, which just give you thousands each time. It's almost inconsequential. I like the jewelry. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave the rat men for now. In fact, let's just, uh, I wanna kill one more. Just wanna see how much experience he gives me. After I've managed to cast some fireballs. 
I can't work out if that first spell I've cast there by mistake is a fireball, uh, sorry, a magic missile or something just completely random. But we'll soon find out. We'll just cast reveal on one of them. Pretty gross. Okay, I'm liking that. Oh, it's knackered, isn't it? Or is it? Looks a bit knackered. Oh no, okay, it's a bit knackered, but it works, so... One left. Oh. Okay, <laughs> so it was the uh, the magic missile by luck of it, but uh, oh wow, I think I've got myself in a little bit of a buggy spot here. I think I've got up this before though. I can't work it out, I can just take one of the balls. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Um, yeah, it appears the magic missile actually requires a bit of aiming. Why do I keep doing that? Whereas the fireball just it's got such good AOE, there we go. Got such good AOE damage that we don't really need to aim it. Alright, so we're on 2300s. Just wanna see how much experience a rat man gives me. Not a rat, a rat man. Quite a, quite a weird uh, sort of biome down here. I'm not sure I'd put this with rat people, but... I want to see how much experience you give me. A couple of hundred. So uh, this is pretty decent. I think I'll kill like 10 of them and we'll get a level. Oh, I don't know how many. Some uncut. I hope that's not his ribs. That's pretty gross. Right. Um, now that I've done that, I just want to I'll head back to the temple now. We'll come back here at some point and clear this out. Pretty sure this is the level where there's some crazy thing that we've got to do. Bats. Yeah. We saw it on the cut. The the sort of this picture for that that level below was the crazy thing. I think these trials are a little bit random. Um, so we'll see if I can uh, stumble my way through it. Do a uh, full save. Oh, not. We'll stick with maze. Oh, save. Because it is pretty much a maze again. Can that save? Yeah. Oh. Well, I'm guessing that means we've got to do that to all of these. <laughs> to find some secret. Far, it is absolutely trolled in me. Okay, never mind. Well, we did a little curtains anyway. Now, ah, this one. Yeah, secret door. Hey. We'll go down there in a sec and see what else is uh, about. Okay, we can just open that. Cool. The weakness of the wealthy snake lies where its sword crosses its scepter. How does that? Locked, locked. Ah. It's a pop. 
possible. Yeah, I don't know how good the loot is that I'm missing out on, and that was uh, probably the useless room as far as uh, secrets was for. Sometimes what you see isn't real. I said about where the sword crosses the scepter, but I mean that's clearly there, and there's a little glitch there to point out the right place. But what does it want us to do to that? Oh, what did it say? Ah, they're everywhere. Alright, let's keep going because I don't know what to do. Maybe some of that. Pretty weird. Okay, right. Definitely remember this being super hard as well. But I suppose it's not necessarily super hard, just like a pain. I'm just not good at puzzles. Right, so we're going to go take this orb at the top of the stairs, I believe, or click it out, stuff like that, and then we'll see what happens. Ah, okay. Is that doing a different one each time? No. Right, what we're going to go and do is drop some stuff down by them. Uh, and then that'll give us the right order. If I can learn how to split stacks. <laughs> uh, you can't draw. You got. Oh God. There you go, dagger. So now when uh, it zooms down, we know which one to go to. Dagger, arrows. That's the theory anyway. Let's soon find out if that works or not. Mana potion. I've not managed to lose... Oh, this is a bit of a dark room, isn't it? Uh, I've not managed to lose a item yeah oh no we did lose a sword right at the start but it, it came back but i just get nervous in these older games just leaving items on the floor because especially if they're a key to the completion of the game bracelets uh, i was gonna say hopefully we can see it but it's massive and a torch there we go all right which one first puzzle master confirmed bracelet which is the one we just did Maybe, maybe uh, hopefully I've not messed it up by clicking some random ones at the start. Mana potion, is that on the right or left? Yeah. Torch, that was... Top left. Oh no. Uh, last, last one. Yeah. The fact that he keeps showing us new ones means it must be, uh, it must be working. Arrows. That was the second one. Top left. Probably should be picking these up after I've uh, been round, but just in case I get it wrong. I've only really got one left now, but I'm going to click the orb just in case. Yeah, so the first one with the dagger. Hey! 
to unlock this. Yeah, okay. Snake bust. Hopefully that's important. Ah, let's open this as well. Fantastic. So, there's some puzzles we've not done yet in the longest route. Strong, strongest or short? Strongest, okay. Uh, there's some puzzles back there we've not done, so I'm hoping that's not going to hold us back. So, I'm just going to... Is this an illusion? Why does this feel like an illusion? do this. Oh. I think this guy tries to battle us. Yeah. Aha! Duped. I think might make a difference on the other side of the mirror now. No. <laughs> uh, okay, so... I tried to shoot arrows at this, but I could not. Um, I didn't have the skill, so with that, we just to shoot that point with an arrow. So we used a magic magic missile. And apparently it worked, which is quite good, because we need 30 to use a bow that I've got, and I've got 29, <laughs> which is annoying. Uh, so I've never gone snake. This fucking game. I definitely tried that and it didn't work. 100%. Okay, right, let's see what's next. Hmm. Is it trolling with us? Well done, you pr Oh. It was definitely spinning us back round, but I've managed to, uh... Luke it. Hopefully. Oh. Backwards, sideways, jump, jump. Here we look. Ah. this game. <laughs> right, so I've been derping my way around here for a little bit and in fact it turns out this button. So just something that's normally part of the scenery is actually a button. Um, yeah, brilliant. Who would have thought it? Hey! Please don't shoot me back, please don't shoot me back. Oh yeah, no, not a button, not a button. Bloody game. If it's not general, it's not worth a thing. Deja vu. Okay. I think one of them is fake things. We've got two. Oh! <laughs> Actually made me jump. Is that a ding as well? Yeah, level up. Cool. We're gonna put some points in casting. Four points in this. More on casting. I think we're gonna need a high amount of casting. The experience means we must have got it right. Uh, let me out. Ah, that's the ring. <laughs> that's why it wouldn't let me out. Sweet. There you go. Oh. Are they going to be magic users? Yes, they are. Fuck. Oh, 
she just kill herself? <laughs> What have I done? You told me to go and get it. Okay, so the snakes, at least these snakes are bad now. Just some spells cast. Okay, no loot. They turn back to stone. Oh no, they have a loot. But they have no loot. Right, let's go back to this temple city. Uh, what was down here then? Okay, no. Yeah, that is that is the way out. It just chucked us back in that front room to give us up battle. Um, so we now have the uh, Zohark and the Kazak Kazal. Kra House and Kazar. Okay. Oh. See you in the Crystal Caves. We have no instructions to give you, and be aware, someone might know about our plans. Okay, I'm guessing that's where the Crystal Caves. That's like right on the first level where that big spider was, isn't it? Panicking if he's uh, offering an allegiance. That's good. Right. This is just another transition. Okay. So I'm going to go back and see the snakes and see if they want to kill me out of interest. Um, hopefully not. And then we will go to the Crystal Caves and see what the next part of the quest is. So I uh, apologize for that being a little bit janky. Um, what do we want to put here? Mental. We're gonna get mental, I think. Yeah, a little bit uh, janky, but this uh, just puzzles a bit too hard for me. Uh, but thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.